All right, bros, what is going on? Insomnia from the Mexican Gamers channel. Welcome to another Battlefield 4 Domination gameplay on Operation Locker. Yeah, I think it's Operation Locker, right? But anyways, man, I'm using the Ace 23 Assault Rifle. Man, oh man, is this gun. This gun is classified as the best gun in Battlefield 4. And let me tell you, that is absolutely bogus. No, I'm just kidding. That's absolutely right, man. This gun is ridiculous. Especially with the red dot side, I really, really like using this weapon. Obviously, because it's very, very good. Look at all this traffic I encounter right here. Unfortunately, I only had a pistol to deal with them, and my teammate got all the credit and all the all the kills, man. But then he dies. I clean this guy that took him out. I revenge my teammate. And then stupidly, I should have just waited like two more seconds. That guy would have ran right into my sights, and I would have had another kill under my belt. But I wasn't that patient. So anytime I cap this this um, A flag right here, I turn off the lights. Why? You're harder to see. I lay down. I lay prone. And I take that bro out right there. Cap me, my, cap myself a very very easy flag right there. Get that bro coming into the doorway. But I always turn off the lights. I recommend you do it, especially if you have a flashlight to go along with your shotgun or any kit you might be using with flashlights and stuff like that to blind the enemy. Trust me, turn off the lights. You'll be a harder target to see, and you'll cap a, an easy flag. So I apologize for this video being in the in the same map as the last Battlefield 4 video that I posted. But this one should look a lot nicer and a lot better because I'm actually recording with an HD capture cards such as the Elgato since I already got all the components that I needed to strip the HDCP off of the PlayStation 4. Sony, I don't think you've patched it yet and that, that makes me pretty angry because I had to spend extra money to, to actually be able to record and bring videos to, to my subs, man. But anyways, man, that's besides the point. The real topic of this video is the little milestone that I set for my, myself and for the channel at the beginning of the year, actually a little bit before the, the year started which was when I received my machinima partnership fun little fact I received the partnership in 12 12 12 meaning the month of December which is month number 12 in the year the the 12th day in December and in in the year 2012 so I received the machinima partnership in 12 12 12 and uh, that, that's when I was like man th this is awesome and I was really excited to receive this partnership not because I was about to start making a whole bunch of money on YouTube, which believe me, I, I didn't, especially not at that time, and I still don't make a lot of money off of YouTube. At that time, when I received the partnership, I had 365 subs, I think. Yeah, I, I know. They don't, they're not as strict in handing out partnerships as they used to be, but I received my partnership, my Machinima partnership, with 360-something subs, and I wasn't excited because I knew that 360-something subs wasn't enough to make you a bunch of money on YouTube. So what had me really excited was that I was now going to have access to this feature called the Scheduled Uploader, which I'm aware if now non-partners have access to this feature, but before, when, when I was, when I, before I received my partnership, uh, you know, I, I didn't have access to this Scheduled Uploader, and this thing was really important to me because I wasn't able to post videos at the time that I wanted to post them, since I would be sitting in a classroom around 3 p.m. During that moment, you know, that's how I had my classes scheduled. So I needed a scheduled uploader to, to continue to post videos to YouTube and, 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 and publish the videos at the time that I wanted them to go live. So the scheduled uploader meant a lot to me. And that's really why I wanted the partnership to begin with. Because I understood that I wasn't going to be able to make a whole bunch of money with 365 subs. And, and getting around a hundred views a video maybe. Now I'm getting a little bit more than that, but still, believe me, if you know how YouTube works, I'm not making a killing off of YouTube. But anyways, man, yeah, so now we're at 2,500 subs, and that was the milestone that I put in my head when, when I received the Machinima Partnership. I said, before the year 2013 ends, I at least wanna reach 2,500 subscribers. And, and here we are, man, a couple of days ago, and now we're sitting around uh, 2520 something but a couple of days ago we actually hit that nice little milestone that I put in my head and you know it, it was it was satisfying you know satisfying reaching it some of you guys might be like yeah you're setting your yourself your bar is set too low but it, it's hard man it's hard to, to grow a huge channel on YouTube it's not very easy and it's very hard to do it by yourself which is what I'm doing I don't, I don't really have the help of any other youtuber <laughs> i just i just have you guys man i just have my subs and my myself you know hopefully with 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 the quality and with with you know the the series that i try to come up with that's that's all i have to to gain subscribers you know one a series that really really helped me gain subs was the dream begins and i'm 
you know, I'm more than excited. Believe me, if you, you might not believe me, you might be like, man, this guy is taking way too long to bring the Dream Begin Season 2 out. But I want this thing to be very, very good. You know, I don't want to rush anything, man. I don't want to rush the Season 2 of the Dream Begins. I, I would hate to, to bring it out and then have, you know, some of the old school guys who have watched Season 1 of the Dream Begins be like, this isn't what it used to be. This isn't as good. So, you know, I, I'm, I'm planning it out and I, I want it to be perfect. I want it to be very, very good and very, very entertaining. And that's a series that really, really helped me gain some sort of momentum and push me into the thousands. That, that, that series really pushed me into the thousands, not only in subs, but in views. Um, a lot of those episodes received thousands of views. Like like the, the first episode has like over 10,000 views, I think. And, and that says a lot because I put so much effort, man. It was around this time when I was planning that series out. I took the... I remember, you know how in school they gave you a Christmas break. Well, it's the same thing in college, right? They gave us Christmas break. And over that Christmas break, I came up with four videos for the Dream Begins episodes. During the Christmas break, I published them in January and you just hope for the best. And, you know, thankfully, my subs really, really liked them. And it was a series that in my own little world, in my own little channel, blew up. <laughs> you know, I didn't receive millions of views, but in my own little space here in this YouTube corner receiving thousands of views for a channel at that, that at that time I had around 400 subs it was huge it, it was huge for me and and that that series really really opened my eyes and and showed me where I needed ahead and what direction that I needed ahead with this YouTube thing and that was with with FIFA 14 content and with with stuff like the my player with with creative stuff like that <laughs> you know, I, I'm, I'm really happy that I went through with that series. But anyways, man, thank you guys for watching this video. We win this domination game and hopefully you guys enjoyed the little story slash um, recap of what this journey has been for me. We reached the milestone, 2,500. Why not make it 5,000? Double or nothing by, by the end of 2014. I'm in for it. I'm in for it. How many of you guys are in for it? Raise your hands in the comments down below. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for watching. 31 and 10 was my final score. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out, bros. And as always, take care.